Hello everyone. Today I'm going to talk about childhood interstitial lung disease. Definition. Various lung disorders, including growth, developmental, and immunological problems that compromise gas action. So we can diagnose childhood interstitial disease. Infant less than two years plus diffuse lung disease plus at least three of four criteria below. First one, respiratory symptom like cough. Second, respiratory sign, retraction, digital clubbing, hypoxemia, diffuse abnormality on chest radiography and OCT. Require exclusion of other common cause of diffuse lung disease. For example, cystic fibrosis, immunodeficiency syndrome, congenital heart disease, bronchopulmonary dysplasia, pulmonary infection, primary ciliary dyskinesia, and recurrent aspiration. More common signs and symptoms. Tachypnea is the most common clinical symptom up to 75 to 90%. Hypoxemia, wheezing, cough, crack cough on physical examination. Other signs and symptoms, failure to strive. Demography. Estimated prevalence around 13 to 16.2 over 100,000 children per year. Pathology. Open lung biopsy often required for diagnosis. Neuroendocrine cell hyperplasia of infant can be diagnosed without lung biopsy if air tripping and obstruction are documented on chest, CT, and pulmonary function tests. Top differential diagnosis of childhood interstitial lung disease, cystic fibrosis, congenital heart disease, bronchopulmonary dysplasia, pulmonary infection, primary ciliary dyskinesia, recurrent aspiration. In radiograph, frequently abnormal but non specific finding. So it can show like diffuse reticular or heterogeneous opacity. First AP chest radiograph of the newborn with pulmonary lung fungiatasia who presented with respiratory distress so diffuse bilateral pulmonary opacity. Second chest radiograph of a three month old boy with subitant deficiency related to A, GP binding, cassette, transporter, A3, C, gene mutation, so diffuse bilateral reticular opacity. This entire entity is also referred to as beta secretan deficiency and has a very high mortality, typically within first month of birth. This is the chair radiograph with a newborn boy with congenital lung fungi, ectasia, and Several respiratory insufficiency requiring mechanical ventilation. 
So extensive reticulation, interlobular subtle thickening, and ground gas opacity, as well as right sided pneumothera. Note the left thoracostomy chest. CT finding. Imaging manifestation varies significantly depending on underlying condition. So we can see diffuse ground glass opacity, interlobular subtle sickness, lungsis, mosaic attenuation, air tripping. This contrast intensity of the patient obtained several letters so extensive issues bilateral interlobular subtle sickening. Sci science of it arrow indicate bilateral low globe atrectasis and a small right pleural fusion science curve arrow indicate pulmonary Lung fungi ectasia is among the disorder that cause severe neonatal childhood interstitial lung disease. Non contrast, non enhanced CT of a patient cell diffuse interlobular. Subtle sickening and crown glass pasty bilaterally as well as left lobe lobe atelectasis, cyan solid arrow in kit. This has CT in a patient, so bilateral ground glass pasty, patchy area of consolidation and interlobular subtle sickening. This is another case of contrast enhanced CT in a two, 22 months old boy with Down syndrome, so small subpleural upper Provenances, science solid arrow indicated. In case of Down syndrome, this findings are more commonly seen in patients with congenital heart disease and may contribute to development of pulmonary hypertension. So this is contrast enhanced CT in patient. So multiple small bilateral peripheral subcortical pulmonary cyst black solid arrow indicated. And this is a chest contrast enhanced CT. So several large subcortical in black upper lobe, black solid arrow, as well as numerous tiny subchlorosis along the major physio white solid arrow indicate. Coronal contrast and hand CT mean IP reformation in a patient so number of sub Chlorosis that prominently affect the bilateral apple. Take home message. Childhood interstitial lung disease is a diagnosis of exclusion and several diffuse lung disease must be considered and excluded. Infant Less than two years old, years of age, prostitutes lung disease, 
and first at least three or four criteria like respiratory symptom, respiratory sign, hypoxia, issues, abnormality on chat, radiography or CT. Thank you.